8474. Sign and bargain. As we all know, I have Sonic Adventure 2 Battle for the GameCube. And it's pretty darn unique in every way. Right? So, yeah, you've got the booklet. It was the same with this one, only it has a different company on the back. It's, it's Atari instead of Infograms. But these are pre this is a pre player's choice. Right, now to the, to the cut into the chase. Um, now, these. Now this is my 360 version of the Drink Ass collection. But this one, because I used it, I'm gonna give this one to my brother for Christmas and I'm going to um going to use the new one from now on and keep another one for the back up in case something happens to the disc. So this should be alright to give to my brother for the 360. It's a must have anyway. I was going to keep it to be honest, but it's really epic. I like it. Remember what I said about my rant that this isn't a rip off? And I had it for $9.99. With the other two, I had for $4.99. And I brought it down. Um, well, I went in the shop. Nah, I didn't see what shop, but uh, yeah. Um, yeah. Drink Ass Collection. Must have the reason to have it Sonic Adventure original Dreamcast title. I don't know if you can see it up close. See, uh, this one I wouldn't have recommended this for the PlayStation 3 because of the reason, but I thought it was pretty good for PlayStation to uh, actually really release it. And it wasn't bad because the PS3 ruled over the other PlayStation consoles. I still don't like him for what they did doing with Sega. However, payback now for, for uh, against PlayStation. Guess what else I got? Uh, yep. And it was straight unboxing, but one of these is staying in the package room. I'm gonna look now to see if there's a broken seal on top. This one is staying in its sealed form. Because I like to keep this, you never know, it may be worth a lot of money, and uh, that's the reason why I'm keeping it in its package. Um, this one, I'm going to reopen this now. Uh, yeah, I'm going to open this now. Um, maybe I shouldn't. Oh crap, was this the right one there? Yeah. Alright, uh, yeah, it. Oh, I wasn't getting, uh, I wasn't getting games like Resident Evil for this time, Resident Evil 5 this time, movie edition for the Xbox 360, or whatever it was, Connects with edition for the 360. No, I was getting this, mother. Mother do, uh, do, uh, dude, um, yeah, uh, I like it, uh, yeah, that's pretty good, um, Sky, Sherbert, no, see, Grass, Grass, what is it, Grass, Grass, Orange grass, sky, uh, sk sky, um, is it sky, Sherbert City? Yeah, it took me ages to. Uh, uh, let's have a look. Um, yeah. Uh, this is a Dreamcast manual. Um, let's have a look. It's Sonic Adventure, so this is Sonic. This is how you get in the game. Um, you jump in a taxi, playing Sonic cr Crazy Taxi. You jump in there with Sonic characters and stuff, you know. Um, yeah. Um, Robocop thing or whatever, the robot. 
I don't know what's his name. But gamma robot thing radiation radiation robot. Uh, this is a taxi, this is how you jump in. Uh, taxi and stuff, crazy bass fishing. And this is Space Channel 5. Uh, Space Channel Fishing, actually, I think it's called. Yeah, you know, so yeah. Um, yeah, so don't worry, it's all black and white. And it's got Sonic 4 in the background. Yep. Another one I will be doing, but I won't be doing it on this video, is my Sonic Adventure for the 360. I like this a lot more than the PS3. Why? Because it's on a disc. It cannot get any better than seeing it on a disc. If you download it, it's not the same. That's the reason why I bought it. Right, out of the way. I have this. Now compare this cover to the PlayStation 3. What do you think is different about this casing? About this casing on you and this one? Have you noticed something different about this one? Yes, they put best seller. Look, Xbox 360 did it. It says best seller. And an award, classic bestseller award, and then it's got Retro Gamer 98%, which means that this is better on the 360. Did PlayStation 3 rate it? Sadly, no, they did not, and it was being too cheap with Sega. They, they said that this game was not great and all this and that and they said they deserve a 4 out of five, uh, four out of 10 Terrible, I only believe in IGN because it's an old game and that And this is only the images on the back If you look at the images on the 360 you see there's more images Alright, so they got Sonic the Hedgehog 2 mixed up with Sonic 3 and Knuckles Or Sonic 3 somewhere on the line But it's still good but look at this one. It's got Sonic. It's done it again on you. So it's PlayStation's fault, really. Not Sega. It's and the Xbox, but can't blame Microsoft. Well, I get to this after. So I'll say another. Muchas gracias for now.